You are getting ready to listen to the voice of Dr. Radi Ferguson. 2004 Olympian. Four-time national judo champion. Brazilian jiu-jitsu black belt. Author, speaker and coach. Hey, what's going on? This is Rod D. Ferguson, 2004 Olympian, four-time national judo champion, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu black belt, author, speaker, and coach. I want to speak to you about something that um, is really important for people who are in relationships, for uh, couples who are raising children, people who are in married relationships. Uh, I, I've seen the, the, the polarity of parenting styles have or create real issues in the, in the household on the in the lives of couples. As a matter of fact, I was at my son's football game and I had an opportunity to speak to a couple who was, it wouldn't necessarily happen an argument, but a slight disagreement on parenting styles. And I had to share an example with the wife in the relationship so that she can understand the, the beauty in the, in, in differences, the beauty in uh, opposite polarity, the beauty in having a hot, cold, a hot approach and a cold approach so that someone can be soaked in love in terms of warmth. I explained to her that raising a child in a household with two different styles, in this particular case, it was a, uh, a hardcore male style and a softer female style. Um, I said, it's, it's akin to getting a pedicure. And she said, what do you mean? I said, well, have you ever had a pedicure before? She said, of course I, I, I had a pedicure before. I said, well, great. I said, well, during the pedicure, there's a point in time when they use a pumice stone. And a pumice stone is a, a rough type of stone that kind of knocks some of the hard edges off of your feet. I said, have you ever, ever had a, a pumice stone used before? She said, of course I have. I said, I said great. So, I said, after the, the pumice stone, I said, then they, they put your foot uh, after a couple of processes in this paraffin wax. And the paraffin wax feels nice, and then they peel everything off. She says, yes, I understand. I said, I said you're the paraffin wax. I said, and your husband is the pumice stone. I said, but when the two things are used together at the right time, I said, they will produce the right outcome. She was like, I never heard it put that way. She said, but that makes total sense. I said, right, it makes total sense. I said, but you cannot think that the paraffin wax goes before the process of the pumice stone. I said, and that's the problem. I said, a lot of times you want to buff and wax before we do the coarse cleaning. And the coarse cleaning has to be done so that when the buffing and waxing comes in, that the process is what it's supposed to be. Because if you walk into the to the to the nail salon and they don't do anything to your feet except for dip them in paraffin wax, you're not going to get what it is that you desire. And if you stop the process of smoothing out some of the rough edges from children, I said, you are going to rob them from their struggle and you're going to rob them from the process that they need to become who they need to become. So for those who are listening, who need this particular message, here's what I want to tell you. When you see your child being scraped against the pumice stone of life, sometimes it's good to understand that that process is necessary for their refining. Now, I did not say that your child needs to be hit in the head with a rock, which is different than being smoothed out with a pumice stone. One process is abusive. The other process is done with love. So take care. Have a great day. This is Dr. Ferguson. Remember, I love you, but God loves you best. And life will sometimes bring pumice stone experiences to you and then dip you in the paraffin wax. But don't rush the pumice stone experience. And don't stay too long in the paraffin wax. Take care and have a great day.